Oh! Hello! Thank you for almost running me over. So I'm wondering who that guy was that Noah was like freaking out over. Oh, hello. Was he a, a arena survivor? Or someone who got hurt in the arena and she was trying to save his life? Off stage? Or was he a Golden Path member who happened to be inside the arena? I, I don't know. All we know is that Nor was really torn up over it. Also, Paul is gonna kill her family. Bam! I don't think I killed it. I don't think I got to drive. Drive. Drive automatically. Dude, you're gonna get fucked over. I'm so sorry, but you are the bait for those rhinos. He is so dead. Nothing. You just happened to be in the wrong place at the wrong time. Okay, actually, he lived. He survived. The rhino fucked off. I'm always happy when other pleasant humans survive. Oh, wait, hold up. No, I have enough yellow ones. I don't need more. I need blue plants, but we aren't really hanging out around the water too much. It looks like the last few outposts the Golden Path recaptured were not a fluke, you guys. The good guys now nearly control half of all the outposts in Kirat. I gotta take a visit to one of these outposts someday, but I keep putting it off. And I think it's partly because of all the horror stories I've heard about the facilities of these outposts. I mean, the facilities are great, and this may make you think less of me, but... I need a clean bathroom and a real toilet before I drop a piece. I know, I know, I'm spoiled, I get it. Some of you guys are thinking, yeah, I mean, you do, you do broadcast out of a bunker. But hey, I <laughs> drop deuces with the best of them. And I can't help it. I don't like squatting and I definitely don't like shitting into a hole in the ground that's already filled with weak old shit from other people. And you know what? I'll say it right now on air. I like my bidet. Yes, I broadcast out of a bunker and you were told you. What the fuck, Robbie Ray Rana? <laughs> he literally just wanted to rant about having a clean asshole. Oh my god. I... As an American, I don't think we have bidets. <laughs> um, I don't think it's a... I think it's something that just happens all the way over there. And I'm sure bidets are effective, but yo, toilet paper and like some wet wipes. Yo, there you go. I don't have to, like, spray water in my ass to be happy. I think that in a place like this... Hello, Boris. Anyways, in a place like this, yeah, it'd probably just be better... ...to avoid the whole situation of having to install a whole bunch of plumbing just so people can use their fancy dancy bidets. With that said, some of these outposts have had bathrooms. At least I assume so. I mean, we've had a, a little safe houses and things like that, so I don't know what he's talking about. Oh, God. Dude, stop, drop, and roll! Stop, drop, and roll! That's just stopping, man! Ah, oh. You should run. It's fire. It is- it is literally going to burn you to death if you continue to just sit there... ...right next to it. No! He's my kill! Do you have a problem with that?! I am the king of the land! No! 
the king of the land has karma. Oh, less karma. Well, at least I can get bait. So this was really unfortunate of an area, because I have no idea how to fucking navigate it. So, you know what? I realize now, fuck it, let's fast travel. I'm like trying to manually go across the way. I didn't realize I could just do this. Okay, so play some body armor. Do I have to pay the full cost to do to replace like 10% of my body armor? Because that would be really lame. Uh anything in here that would be interesting to read? A rice-filled burlap sack from a human uh, humanitarian NGO. Glad to see you're not above stealing food from the poor for fun and profit. Yeah, I am totally above that. Uh, I wouldn't... I wouldn't do that if it were... amusing. Well done! He was a terror to this land. When word spreads that Sergeant Mizra is dead, the people will rejoice. Oh yeah, this is the outpost with the dude who was like, Oh, can you go kill this guy? And then hide his body behind rocks? It's very important that you do that. Thank you. Alright, I need a car. I don't know if there are any cars around here. But I heard one. I need to come to- wait, 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 hello. Oh no. Oh no. I'm draw- <laughs> I'm gonna drive this piece of crap- alright! The Royal Army won't know what hits them! I have three wheels of glory, friends! Oh. Alright. I mean, I was just gonna casually walk into the base from a different side, but I can find out things. Is that Paul? No, that's the meat! Gotcha! Okay. So this isn't the party compound. I was, uh, I was a little wondering why this place was looking a little drab. So I gotta get in the back of that truck. I'm wondering what she means by meat, though. It's always in, like, parentheses. Not parentheses, uh, quotation marks. Which means it's not really meat! It could be slaves. Prostitutes, that kind of stuff. Gonna hide the body in the not the bush, I guess. Okay. <laughs> I try, man, but he just decides I'm gonna fling the fucking body. Alright, so I'm in a really bad position because I didn't know about like the layout of the base until we actually got here. See, preferably, I should have come in from the back side. So I think I'm just gonna have to navigate my way around. Shut up, dog. You heard nothing. I hope so, at least. Alright. As long as no one's looking in this direction... We should be able to sneak across. Whew. Yes. This place is pretty heavily guarded. I think if I accidentally got alerted, I think the least of my worries would be Paul running away. Because I'd probably be dead. Very quickly. But then again, I have explosives. Which I don't want to use. Alright, we have two guys in the backside. If I can take them out quickly. Then we'll be fine. See? Prisoners! Meat! I knew it! Oh, 
Last cause. Moving! Moving! Don't stop firing! You don't know that I'm here. What are you talking about? <laughs> Sup. No, oh, damn! Enemies alerted. The convoy will not leave. Ah, that's my fault, I guess, for missing a headshot. AJ, did you get my family? Not yet. I'm making my way there. Okay. Look, you must sneak in. It's important. Paul is a rat, and rats always find a way off a sinking ship. He can't suspect anything until it's too late. And don't forget, AJ, he's throwing a party. So find out where he's kidnapping his meat and sneak in with him. Yeah, I, I get you. I just have to make it over to the area without anyone seeing me. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Like, I don't- I don't even know. I could- I swear, I'm aiming at the head. And then they're like, nah, you weren't. Amita, I'm going after Paul. That's really dangerous, Sajay. We want him alive to pay for what he's done, but be careful. Uh, and Ajay, if you can, take pictures of his interrogation chambers. It'll go a long way in convincing people that he's a monster. Just keep your head down. Don't Holy shit. You. Don't get caught. Uh, so this is kind of bad. I don't have enough syringes to cover the entire base. Because I forgot to grab blue flowers again. Uh oh. We'll be fine. Just gonna keep an eye out for things. We don't want to be detected, and we don't want to start up a fight. Look, it's a party! Why don't you guys get it done? Uh -huh. Oh no, poor lady. I should be taking a picture of this. She's obviously not enjoying it. The world needs to see how awful the Royal Army is. Gal. Hide the bodies. Yeah, I got you. Don't worry. I'm just gonna throw it right back in the spot. Although, maybe throwing it into the back alley is a good idea. Here you go. Hopefully no one finds him. Ah, oh, God. I'm navigating blind here, man. I don't know where everyone's gonna be. Oh, no. Dead dude. Shoot. Alright. So, I'm assuming that Paul's gonna be up there. <laughs> but for now, we have to take pictures. We're serving two causes at the same time. Damn, that guy's fucking rocking out! Bag on men! Yeah! Oh no, oh, come on, don't notice me, man. I'm just trying to get across the rooftops. It's fucking hyper alert, dudes. It's a body! Get it on! And just completely ignore what's going on here. Oh shit. I 
I helped! I'm surprised it actually worked! Alright, buddy. You shouldn't have to worry about getting electrocuted anymore. Oh! Oh, no! Uh, God damn it. I didn't know there was a guy below me! <laughs> that was really unfortunate. Yep, directly below me too. You son of a bitch. Oh, come on! Fuck off! Okay, so here is my logic in that situation. You might go, well, Gum, why are you getting mad? You just did the same thing twice. But no. See, my logic in the situation was... He was actually... I thought he was further behind when he detected me. Because, you know, patrol patterns. So I was like, alright, well, if I'm directly above him, he shouldn't know that I'm here now. But nope, he's a fucking asshole. So this is how he's gonna go out this time. Dick. No one find the body. I got... It really sucks hiding bodies in this game. You can't get them the way you want them to. Shoot. I just need to get a picture. I gotta get up there somehow. Or maybe... I come in from a different angle. Aha! Fuck. Oh, dude, are they burning his feet with, like, acid? He's definitely not alive anymore. Oh, jeez. Alright, so now we have to backtrack a little bit because, unfortunately... I did not realize... How important getting the goddamn pictures were. Was. So I really, at the moment, I need to equip a sounding syringe so I know where everybody is. Ah, oh, there's a dog there. Two dogs. Shoot. I'm being as fast as possible because I don't want the dude to like turn around as I'm directly to his right. Those aren't dogs, those are fucking wolves! <laughs> oh man! Anita, I got your pictures. Paul's one sick fuck. I can only imagine, Reggie. If there's any good to take from this, it will be that we can use these to destroy Pagan Min's lies. Don't spend any longer there than you have to, huh? Yeah, I got you. I'm trying to get out of here as fast as possible. Thank God this guy's just kind of. He. He ain't feeling it too well. Actually, I guess he's feeling it more than everybody else. Alright, so I was right in assuming that De Pleur's office was all the way at the top of the area. And I just sneak by everybody. Ooh. What? You're alive again? I don't even know why he tells me to hide the bodies. Oh shit. So ironically, by heading over to hide the body, I got detected. Because there was a dude there and I didn't know. Got your pictures. Paul's one sick fuck. I can only imagine, okay? If there's any good to take from this, it'll be that we can use these to destroy Bacon Min's lies. Don't spend any longer there than you have to, huh? Well, at least it keeps- whenever I die, and it sends me back a checkpoint, I get all the things back. Fuck you, I'm not hiding the body. No one's gonna come over here. No one. Alright. Okay. 
I got really scared there. I thought they found the body, like, five seconds after I left the area. Someone get the shit cleaned up! Oh, okay, I'm sorry!